Hello, this is Virgil Prime, and uh, if you've ever used Wacom's graphics tablets for drawing or anything like that, then you know, uh, at least on Windows, that the drivers crash a whole lot, and it really sucks. And uh, generally, in the old days, you had to restart your computer. Um, the Wacom Center used to be able to uh, bring up your tablet and then have a nice little... Uh, drop down list with an option to restart your drivers and that doesn't exist anymore um, right now if the drivers for your tablet crash then you just have to restart your computer if you even try to open Wacom Center it'll tell you that and that sucks but hey guess what so back before that was even a thing in Wacom Center I made a program to restart the drivers and you can go ahead and go here and I'll link this in the comments below to download it. Now you, there's an exe file and if you try to download it this way it's going to give you a warning so uh, I'll click download and you can see that uh, it isn't commonly downloaded and so my web browser doesn't want to download it because it's it's all concerned that it might be a virus and that's totally you know understandable. So you don't need to download this .exe file if you feel adventurous you can but if you go to this .bat file you can see all of the code for this program. And uh, as you can see, it's very complicated and hard to understand. It says net stop W Tablet Service Pro and net start W Tablet Service Pro. And after five years, it still works. So uh, if you want to download this and run this so you can see exactly what the code is, click on raw and that's going to open this bat file, which is just a text file, all right, with some commands in it. And then uh, I'm going to hit control S to save. I'm going to save it into this folder. Uh, and uh, we'll get into something in just a second. Save. All right, there it is. Um, now, open. There we go. So it's going to save it as a text file, and if you double click on this, it's just going to open up in a notepad, and you can see that it still has the same code. Um, but we don't need that. So what we need right now is just to change the file extension, and if you don't have file extensions enabled, um, go to View or whatever it is on your particular version of Windows, um, and go ahead and find show hidden, uh, no, file name extensions, and make sure that's turned on. And once you have that turned on, you're gonna see .bat.txt. Go ahead and remove .txt, and that makes it a bat file, which is a batch executable file. And now if I run this, Okay, more info. You already saw what the code is. You know it's safe. Run anyways. And it does that. And it re the drivers are restarted now. So if my uh, Wacom desktop center wasn't opening before, it would be now because the tablet drivers are working and I tested that five minutes ago. So uh, link in the description. And thanks for watching.